Hey everybody and welcome back. Shane here. Today we're going to do an intermediate guitar lesson on the song Tell Me Baby off the album Stadium Arcadium by the Red Hot Chili Peppers. Go ahead and grab your guitar, get tuned up, let's get to work, alright? <laughs> can be broken down into three parts. We have our intro, our verse, and our chorus. The intro only contains five chords. We have an F, C, G, A minor, and D minor. The intro is finger picked, so I like to tuck my pick into the knuckle here on my middle finger so that I can pop it out as soon as I need it for the verse. To start, we'll start with this F chord. We'll be playing the D and G string together with our thumb and first finger, and then picking the B string with our ring finger. Now this pattern will hold true for most of the chords. Then we'll use the root note and G string, this time the A string and G string on our C. Same with our G, the root note and the G string, so E string and G string. On the A minor, we want to pick the D and the B string together and then come back to the G. The second time through, we'll play our F, C, and G chords as normal and then strum our D minor chord. The third bar through is the same as the first with F, C, G, and A minor. Then to finish that intro, we'll do F and C as normal, and then strum a G major chord. I barred across the third, you may also play it open, either way is fine. For part one of our verse, we'll be focusing on the A minor scale in the fourth position. I'll go ahead and play through it once, and then we'll start breaking it down. We're going to be focusing primarily on the D and G strings. We're going to start on the 12th fret of the G and we'll go to 14. And then down to 14 on the D string. Second time through, just double pick that 14 on the D string. Same thing. To end it off, we'll stay on the G string, we'll go 12, 14, 12, then on the B string, 13, pull 12. That very last part is... The second part of the verse has us barring across the 12th fret on the 1st, 2nd, and 3rd strings, and then the second part of that is barring across the 15th fret on the 1st and 2nd string. is going to use the same chords as the intro, so we have F, C, G, A minor, and D minor, but with a few key changes. Number one, we're going to jump everything up an octave, and number two, we're going to be arpeggiating only certain notes of the chord instead of playing through the whole chord. We'll start with that F, but we'll only be using the G and B string, so 14 on your G string and 13 on your B string. We'll move to a C, again only the G and B string. Then our G is barred 12 across on the G and B. Then our A, we will use 13 on the B and 14 on the G. 
the second part, when we go to that D minor, go to your D minor, and this time we're going to use the E, G, and B string, and the picking is like this. One more time so you can see. To end that all off, we're just going to bar cross 12 for our G string. There is a very short solo in this song, again in the key of A minor. We're mostly going to be focusing on the A and D strings around the 10th and 12th fret. You can do some triplets, hammering on on the D and down to the A, or hammering on on the A and down to the D. Eventually, you're going to walk up your A minor scale all the way to the 17th fret on the high E string. Any kind of walk up should work there as long as you end on the A note, which is what his solo ends on and what you're really looking for there. Well, those are some things to think about when learning how to play the song Tell Me Baby by the Red Hot Chili Peppers off the album Stadium Arcadium. Remember to keep that guitar handy, keep it tuned, and keep rocking. My name is Shane, and I'll see you back here soon.